Hello, Yetu. This is Miss Olu. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to do take away. How to take away a number from another number. And we can call it subtraction as well. In year two, you should be able to do this in your head. But for children that are in year one as well, uh, for the purpose of the children that don't know how to do this, we'll start with a simple question. I'm going to go over a, a few questions for you in subtraction because one parent asked me to do this video for our children. Okay, so if you're, if you're not sure how to do this in your head or if you know how to hold, you hold number nine in your head first, and you count backward because when we are taking away, we are counting backward. So, for instance, we have nine take away three. We have nine in our head. We hold it in our head. Then we count back eight, seven, six. So, you have six. The answer will be six. But for children that can't do that in their head, they can draw a number line like this. Then you start with your nine here. Okay, you write your nine here. And you take away one, nine take away one is eight. You take, you take another one away and you will have seven. You, and then take another one away, then you will have six. So you jump backward three times. One, two, three, and you land on six. So that's why you have six as your answer. Okay, so we are going to quickly do another one question. So the second one we're going to do is 18 take away 6. Okay, so hold 18 in your head, count backwards 6 times. Okay, 17. Are you counting with me? 17. Let's start again. You have six feet. You are counting backward from 18. Okay. 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12. So 18 take away six is 12. Okay. If you can't do that again, draw a number line. You start here from 18. You take away one at a time. So you have 17, take another one away, you have 16, take one away again, we're jumping six times, you have 15, take one away again, you have 14. How many jumps have we done so far? One, two, three, four. We need to jump two more times, take one more away, you have... 13 then we jump one more time we have 12 take away one so that's why you get 12 18 take away 6 equals 12 okay so we are going to do two more questions some numbers that are very tricky we do that now what about if you have 80 take away 10 hmm what do you think you could do to help you with this 80 take away 10 if you know your 10 times table, all you need to do is to count backward 10 times, okay? All right, so you just take 10 away from 8. Let's say I know I have 80 in my head. I'm jumping backward 10. Okay, that would be 70, okay? But if you don't know, we draw a grid like this. Remember the grid? We have our 10s, 10 units because this is 10 and this is 1s. Then we have 1s here. Okay, so we draw eight tens. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That makes eight tens. Okay, so 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. So you are taking 10 away. So you just cross out 10. How many do you think you have left? 10. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. So you have 70 left. Okay? The standard, you take 10 away from 80. Okay? You have 70 
left you draw your grid like this you watch this video over and over again then you understand so let's do the last one the last one that we are going to do is actually i'm going to do two more quickly because of time 64 take away 11. Ooh, how do we do that we are going to draw a grid again okay so we have 64 we do one two we draw six tens one two three four five six we have 60 here and four we make four ones two three four we're taking 11 away okay so we cross out the 10 first and ones okay 10 11. so what do we have left we have how many tens left 10 20 30 40 50. we have 50 and here we have how many ones we have three ones so 64 take away 11 is we add the numbers together at the end so we have 53 okay yes the last one we're going to do now is 54 this one is a bit tricky for some children but i'm going to show you an easy way 54 take away 8 54 take away 8 okay so we are going to go and draw our grid again so we do tens again all right so we have tens ones here so we draw one we draw how many lots of tens we draw five tens make 50 two three four five so we have five tens making 50 here and we're going to draw how many ones four ones one two three four hmm how many are we supposed to take away hmm now we have to take away eight how do i do this i'm not sure how to do this i haven't got eight ones so what do i need to do i think i need to borrow i need to borrow i'm gonna take this 10 from here and turn it i'm gonna draw a little arrows here to help me because i'm borrowing it so i'm i we need to borrow him then we are going to make him into 10 into 10 ones okay so we're gonna do one two three four five six seven eight nine ten because we've borrowed him from here we have to cross him out it's no longer 10 anymore so now we have lots of ones we can now borrow our eight from it so one two three four five six seven eight see now how many tens do we have left here 10 20 30 40 we have 40 tens here uh, four tens here making 40 and how many ones one two three four five six we have six so 40 add six is 46 and that's how you do your takeaway with two digits and one digit i hope this helps guys remember you need to keep practicing until you get better at it and i will still be making more videos about sharing multiplication and everything division soon bye guys and thank you for watching bye this is miss olu